In this video, I want to show you how to repair a shark dual clean head. If you see here, if that roll is not spinning, I'm going to show you how to get it done. Those are all the screws that need to be removed in order to open the lid. The one at the very bottom needs to remove the little wheel. I'm using one eight of an inch uh, screwdriver, flat screwdriver, and I had a position uh, as you see in the photo in order to have access to remove them. Uh, and because I don't have like the exactly tool for it and I'm pretty sure many of you I mean I, I think I do have it but it's like not deep enough in order to access all the way to the bottom uh, some of them are like deeper and uh, I need an adapter and this doesn't fit this is why uh, the only tool that I have available was a one eight of an inch flat screwdriver and I'm pretty sure you can easily get one of those uh, you gotta remove this little lid in order to access those two screws right there uh, in order to remove completely the, the lid and uh, once you remove those uh, two of those uh, it's completely now uh, you're going to be uh, able to remove it completely as you see here now this is just going to come right off uh, and i will show you here the area where the bell was broken right there uh, i already removed that was the old one so i ordered this uh, on amazon and uh, here's the kind of like screenshot uh, coming up uh, with the part name or number right there and uh, those are like perfect uh, fit for it. I mean, I can't believe that just fit uh, flawlessly. You know, I was uh, I was surprised because some reviews say it, like it's too big and yada yada yada, but actually it works really well. Uh, here's the area that you gotta like kind of like uh, like little stretch a little bit, it's like nice tight fit, but it works perfect. Like once you uh, like put a nice and in snug in there, you do the reverse process. You put everything back make sure all the cables are still fine and uh once you position and everything it takes sometimes a little wiggle you know wiggling a little bit here and there uh make sure that little um it's like a little release button that you gotta make sure that it's positioning well uh i guess just put attention when you're removing this in order to just put it back it's not that complicated to be honest uh and i'm gonna show here just to make sure uh, that you're doing the right thing uh i will show you right there that one that one is the one has to be uh be popped up like you see you press it and it has to be doing that function and that's for uh removing the blue roll in the front uh in order to remove it and put it back because you know you gotta remove the hair uh, make sure in order to prevent this kind of damage you gotta remove the hair uh, you see you put the two screws back i put the lid back and now i'm gonna uh, try to put everything back all the screws remember the one underneath the wheel i use that tool in order to remove the wheel and this, <laughs> this is what I broke that one. So uh, this is how I, I guess I learned on this one. Uh, it's not a big problem. Still uh, has like 90, 95% of the screws. Uh, put the back the roll. Uh, try to like, you see now that I'm moving it, the front roll is moving. Uh, it's supposed to, you know, the way it's supposed to uh, operate. And uh, I guess I'm gonna like uh, finalize, uh, finish everything on the screws and uh, make sure that I, everything is nice and tight. And that's, that's what I here show you, like one eight of an inch. Uh, flat a screwdriver in order to uh, uh, open and you see it like I just put it right in the edge like I you know just it's, it's like it's perfect fit it just fits between um, and, and, and it's enough uh, you have enough leverage enough power to twist it and remove all of them uh, I had done it in the past so that's why I remember so like oh, I don't have the proper uh, a tip but uh, with that one it happens to be that I have that uh, a nice assortment of screwdrivers and that one was the one that fits perfectly and if it's, this video has been helpful uh you can share it um with someone else they can you can help them out how to resolve this issue instead of, like throw away your vacuum that you good working vacuum you know this happened when sometimes it get like stuck in something if, it, if you break the belt and i know my wife said i can't use this i need i need this uh to be working uh properly and i was like either way you fix it or buy a new one it was like wait 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 i can i, I can i can take care of this don't worry <laughs> so uh, i look it up uh the part it was not that hard to find uh, this i put you the little screenshot so you should be able to get uh, one of those if you have the same issue uh thanks for uh watching uh please share and please subscribe uh it helps a lot and re it really motivates me to keep uh to posting videos uh Thanks for everything, and uh, I will continue bring more uh, quality content for you guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.